What is up guys? Welcome back to another episode of Ryan Myers Expeditions. Today I came down here to the harbor to clean my taco for today's film and I bumped into my buddy Justin here who has an interesting story for you guys today. I come here and this is what I find here on the deck. Marlin here is missing its eyeball there. All right, what do we think? Justin, yeah. what are you at? 158. 158. I'm gonna go 157. <laughs> what else, what else we got? What do we got? 190. 190? It's touching. It's gonna be 190. Get it up there. I'm telling you, I have 190. Sonali's got 172. Sam's got 170. Oh, what do you got? One, 148, 140, 138, one, 138. With the eyeball, 140. 140 with the eyeball. Justin's gonna tell us why the eyeball is missing here in a second. So I tore Justin away and he's gonna tell us real quick what happened. First pop, right? Say hi, Uncle. He's gonna beat up Ryan in like two months. Very, very soon. Oh, buddy. It was so super, super epic. We, we found a floater out there or a buoy or something and um, had a bunch of mahi-mahi underneath it. Shot a couple of mahis and then as soon as we left, we started to come in, left the lures out and we weren't trolling for more than these 10 or 15 minutes and uh, we had a huge boil behind our uh, short corner so we had all intentions of tagging it and such and uh, so I started to leader it and just having a blast leadering and he came up and when he came up we realized it was hooked in the eye and uh, usually if they're hooked in the eye you try and, and harvest them then and try and take them out and so as I was pulling him in his whole eye socket that's insane <laughs> popped out I and lost him yeah, and the marlin swims away, and I'm sitting there like, so I quickly grabbed my mask, the snorkel fell off my mask, so I just put it on swimming goggle style, put my fins on, bailed over, loaded my gun, and I could see it, and it was swimming away. And finally I get above to the surface, it, and he's probably 30, 35 feet down, and I drifted right above him, and then I shot him right in his head, and with, strung him with my single roller. With the 115 single roller. My 115 single roller that I've shot Cole with. He took off, and I just started chasing after him, they threw my tagline, I clipped my, my gun onto that just in case yeah. and uh, got dragged around for over two miles. My cousin jumped in the water and handed me my knife, pulled him back in wow. and then this time went down there and stabbed him twice and he took off again. And, yeah. uh, and then the third swing with my knife, yeah. I brained him and he just went like this and came to the surface and it was freaking well, epic. Well, that was Justin's first Marlin. First. First Marlin. First Evan. I, I, I'm not sure if it's full credit because it was maimed first. <laughs> yeah, you can't really <laughs> Does it really it, count? But, but guys, if you want to see me and Justin go out on the Kraken and do this where we drag the lures and then not catch it, where you tease it up and then you jump off and you shoot them, yeah. let us know down below. I have to go, I have to clean this taco right now because the sun is going down. That was an epic like stop on the way home and uh, we'll see you where I'm cleaning taco, I guess. Justin took 10 years telling me his Jaylee stories and I never got a chance to clean my taco in the tide pool like I was planning to because after the last time, I swore I would never do it here in my sink again. But with no ink sack and guts involved and actually with freezing at first, like I'm pleasantly surprised. Like this thing is already curling. I've only been doing it for a few seconds. I'm gonna try and get as much slime as I can. I'm gonna use some salt, I'm gonna use some lime. While I'm doing this, we're gonna play the clips of me catching this one and a couple others underwater. And then Sam is gonna show you her new contraption where we're gonna have a secret weapon on how we're gonna cook this guy and make him delicious. But for now, we'll see you in the water.
god, the thing is huge! Alright, let's go home. <laughs> not like that, huh? Alright. I'm not gonna it. Put my mask off again. <laughs> Another giant, huh? That's a big one. <sighs> All right guys, so now we gotta show you our new secret weapon. We really bought this anticipating that someday maybe my arrows will fly straight and I will kill an animal that we can cook in it. Sam, what'd you get? I got an Instant Pot. I love it, I can't wait. Um, really wanted one because one time Justin made Lao Lao's in an Instant Pot and they were so freaking good and then he made the Kahlua pork pig, whatever, in the Instant Pot, and it was so, so freaking good. And so, I made my own dreams come true. And then we found out that possibly the best way ever to cook a taco is in the Instant Pot. So we went, we got one, and that's what's happening right now. The taco is in with one cup of water and some lemons, and we're gonna press pressure cook. It's on high pressure, and then we want 15 minutes. So we have no idea what we're doing. We just, what? It's on! Is that good? That's it! So we just went through the test run. It's a, it's, it's like a spaceship here that's gonna cook our octopus here. So we'll see. We will see you guys in like 15 minutes. All right, Instapot is beeping. Sam is making potatoes, but guys, you've gotta see this right here. You, you guys are used to seeing them as little demons. Look at this. That is a puddle of six kittens asleep, just stoked on life. What are you doing, Sam? We are gonna quick release the steam. Quick release it. Ah! I'm scared. Ah! Look at that! Wow! Holy crap, guys, we've just cooked an <laughs> octopus like nothing. I'm gonna make a chimichurri. So, so funny. Um, we love Argentina. We have a lot of friends in Argentina. I love chimichurri. Um, one of our Argentinian friends shared this incredible pulpo, is what they call it in a Spanish recipe, but it comes with chimichurri and grilled octopus, and I'm so excited we're gonna try it out tonight. The goal here is to separate these tentacles into nice big chunks. So we do not have a grill, but what we did just buy was this little doohickey, little cast iron grilly thing. Guys, I wish you could smell this. Oh my gosh. Oh my freaking gosh, I wanna eat it. I don't know. Sam, first bite. I'm so excited. Oh my god. <laughs> Are you serious? The flavor is amazing. Mmm. Try it. Oh my god. Oh my god. Guys, that was freaking incredible. I'm so excited to finally understand the taco, to be able to find them here in Hawaii, and now also be able to cook them. Mm -hmm. Because this one's freaking rad, and that Instant Pot was a freaking game changer. So good. Mm. Guys, thank you so, so much for watching. Drop a like if you haven't already, it really helps us out. Let us know what you think down in the comments below. If you're looking for a cat, mm. we'll put that email down below. I gotta eat, I'm starving. And we'll see you next time right here again on Ryan Myers Expeditions.